with us three girls, I think all of us are probably known and have a reputation. It's like, I'm the one from Geordie Shore. You're the loved up one from Love Island. <laughs> You're the crazy girl from the Valleys. <laughs> and with the baby. I, 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 I used to be the crazy girl from the Valleys. <laughs> but I feel like it's more like mum, sexy mum now, I yeah. guess. Yeah, I yeah. think that. Yeah. I think that's true. Yeah. I think What's we, yours? Mine's probably the bit of the quiet one from Geordie Shaw, believe it or not. <laughs> Did you just say the quiet <laughs> one from Geordie Shaw? I don't Geordie think Shaw. you were the quiet one. the other girls. Maybe not the quiet one, but the less popular one. <laughs> no. no. I do think it I is. I feel like you were the funny, couldn't give a shit one. Yeah, yeah. but I, I'd never wanted to be that one. You're I the original. To be, yeah, but I always sort of wanted to be like the other girls because you got to think when we all started, it was me, Charlotte, Holly and Vicky. Back then, I was sort of in the background and I think like, my reputation now is probably oh yeah that's the one that was in the relationship for all them years in Georgia Shore. I just I just think of you crazy Sophie from Georgia Shore. Yeah, yeah you're still I don't like think... Georgie Shore. Yeah. Does that yeah. annoy you? Because like I might be known as the crazy girl from Georgie Shore, like sometimes people don't want to work with the crazy one. Mm. <laughs> so it is a lot different. And I you might get crazy different word to me and you might get different word to me. So it, it works to me advantage sometimes and sometimes it doesn't. Yeah. I'd say Olivia has the best reputation yeah. right now. She's like, like the, the marriage. <laughs> like if only they knew. Girl next door. I think it is because I was always loved up. Like I was just like I was the weird loved up one and I think because I found Alex like and that is we're seen as a couple as a two but like you said with Julie Shaw they gave us such a big platform and they're such a huge brand like Love Island I'm still Olivia from Love Island yeah mm. um, and it is hard to sort of change that not that you really want to or you're that bothered but it does affect how people look yeah. at you like you're the girl from reality aren't you yeah you did mm -hmm. reality tv you're the girl that slept with someone on tv yeah. that I still get that did you, you slept you with him but he's your husband yes, so. <laughs> yeah. and I think it's but it's the same thing as like you did those things on Geordie Shore you did those things on the valleys I never slept things. with anyone Ever. Not so everyone someone, but you always got drunk. Thinks, oh, like, I was crazy in the valleys, I mean. like absolutely. But you like, was younger then, so yeah. why should that, you know, be who you are now? So, you yeah, still change. Exactly, yeah. But for some reason, people won't let go of that. People yeah. still think, oh, you, like that's still you. But no, you grow up yeah. in three years, you change as a person. Exactly, everyone changes. I feel like people look at me and think, why is she dressed like that? Because she's a mum. I don't feel like oh, I'm the everyday do. mum. Do you know what I mean? No, you are relatable. And sometimes I'm like, oh God, can I post that? Because you worry like, about your reputation. Yeah, of course, because like I'm a mum now, mm. so I do. I have toned a lot of things down. But then when I do post the booty pic or something, yeah. I get I get hate for it. Like yeah. so much hate for it. They're like, you're a mum now. I'm like. I, I, I'm no, still young, I, I could still show my body off if I want to, do you know what I mean? That doesn't make me any less of like a good mum. Yeah. yeah, you know, I've obviously got drunk, I fell out of clubs and people think that's bad, but in reality that's, that's what, what we all do. It's normal. <laughs> we just been filmed. Yeah, yeah, exactly. exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think like as like women, we should, does society expect us to worry about our reputation more than guys? Oh, 100%. Yeah. Like, like you said about Geordie Shaw, like the guys were doing then, the same thing you were doing. But the girls would get loads of hate for it, and they got, it, it's nothing the boys to the guys. Were like, it was like a lads thing to do, like yeah. even on Love Island, like yeah. the lads get with all the girls. It's like, yes, go on, yeah. son. But, but when girl. the girls do it, they're like, whoa, bitch, <laughs> like, yeah. that's not on. I think personally, one of the worst reputation you can have is be branded a slag. Like, I think that is such a horrible thing to say about mm. a girl. The other day, I put a photo with me and my boyfriend, and my tongue was out, and they're like, How many dick has your tongue, tongue been around? Or so bad. how many times have like, In this industry, you have a lot of male friends because that's you, you're just friends with everyone, yeah. do you know what I mean? And I was literally with my male friend the other day, and we put up a snap together. The amount of booze I got for that as well. You you're like, you're a slag, you're a whore, I bet, I bet he put his dick in you. And I'm just like, what? He's my friend. We were, like, we were out as a group, do you know what I mean? So it's, it's crazy how, like, he didn't get any hate for yeah, that. Yeah. But, but the amount of hate I got for yeah. that, because I'm with a male friend. Yeah. Like, if we're talking about reputations that, like, you wouldn't want to have as a person, is someone that's nasty. Cause so many people have, like, a nasty reputation. Yeah. For example, like, Piers Morgan, like, he's just nasty, isn't yeah. he? Or, like, who's that Helen Woods? She's just, like, she's just yeah, nasty she's about Yeah, people. like, you get branded. Yeah. I'd rather be a slag than nasty. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. I'd rather be branded a slag than like, nasty. Like, there is, like, events yeah. that I go to and people talk about certain other celebs or whatever and go, oh, my God, she's awful. Yeah. yeah. Like, you don't want that. that. That's horrible. horrible. So if mm. you're being told you're nasty, for example, Helen Woods will then go be nasty and she'll yeah. use it to get press, she'll get PR from it. Mm. I, do, I do get why people, if they're being called a slag and then they go out and pretend that they are, I get that and it's sad, yeah. but I get mm. it. You just sort of live up to your yeah. reputation, I suppose. Yeah. And it's the saying, isn't it? Living up to your reputation, but sometimes it's not true. I think sometimes I do it, like sometimes I might be the girl from Geordie Shore, so I'll, I'll be like the that. girl like Geordie Shore, mm. yeah. like I'll be like that, but then 
in reality, I'm not like that all the time. Mm. So I think sometimes I do live up to my reputation. Yeah, you know, mm. like when people are like, oh, she's the bubbly fun one. And then yeah. that day you just feel like shit. Like you don't want to be the bubbly and fun one. And then they're one. like, mm, she's not even like she isn't. Yeah. Really. And I'm like, I mean, we have got good ones. Like we're not known as like the horrible girls. No, yeah. I mean, we are known as the nice girls. <laughs> I'm like, I hope you are. <laughs>